Happy good Friday morning to everybody. Um, hope you're doing well. If you are um, practicing Christian, happy good Friday. Uh, today is actually a very solemn day in our in our religion. Um, and I have always... I've got thoughts about Good Friday, but anyway, let's 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 do something here. Let's do another one of Alina's cards. If you're interested in these cards, the link is in the description box below. I'm going to do this one. <coughs> Bloom. It's got uh, two different ways to draw this. Oop, wrong way. The first way is with a rounded petal. So you start with a teardrop and then you add one here and then see how that like overlaps? Then one there and then one here and one here and then you do the little petals coming down the side. Then or you can start with a rice-like shape and do the same thing. Come up and over, up and over, up and over four times, and then with pointy petals coming down. We're going to try both. And then she did it in a, she always does mandalas, so of course she did it in a mandala, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Let's do a, what size? Let's do one of these sizes. What color do we, what color do we feel like today? Let's do, let's do, let's do a beige. I know we did beige on the last one, but I'm going to do beige again. And I'm going to, I think, do kind of like a, Let's do a let's do a border. Like that. And we're gonna do things coming out of here. And I'm gonna do one kind of like a branch here, here, and here. We're gonna do three branches and coming off of this. I'm going to do the pointy one here. And a pointy one here. And a pointy one here. Like that. And then coming off of here, I do the roundy shape ones. Like that. We're going to build ourselves kind of a thing like that. Did I was I completely off screen again? I may have been because I do that. I forget that I'm all zoomed in when I show you the card and I don't zoom back out. I'm sorry. That's just my general plan anyway, so you didn't miss anything. Uh, let's do pen and we are going to do the rice shape here. Like that. And then we're going to go up and over, up and over, up and over, and up and over. And we're gonna four of those. And then three petals down the side. 
pointy petals. corner just like that okay so we're going to do another one here a rice like shape I'm going to come down a little bit more so it doesn't stick so far out of the border up and down up and down I started on the wrong side but that's okay So, and then this one is going to be a rice like shape. And then up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, and pointy petals. like that. And then we're going to do some teardrop shapes. So let's do one here. Over, 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 and over with roundy petals. that. Oh, I like these. I like these a lot. They're easy to do and they, they don't take a lot of thought. And I always love an organic shape. Do I want more? I want more of something, but I don't think I want more blooms. So let's do some just branches with dots at the end to kind of fill in. This may have a pattern name. 
If it does, I don't know what it is. But it may. That's better. It needed... It needed something to fill in those empty spaces. And then I am going to put a border, but I think I'm going to... Let me erase. Do I want to erase? No. Let's use my brush pen. There it is. Make a nice brushy border. that. Perfect. Okay, that was easy. Let's erase all those pencil marks. Okay, what was the name of this pattern? B L O E M. And then we can either shade or color. I'm just going to shade. Just come back in there with our blending stump and do just a little bit of blending. That will, that will do it. So I was saying I have I have thoughts about Good Friday. I have always wanted and and our church has never done it and I think I think if I had approached our one of our pastors passed away. She was only with our church a very short time. Um I don't even think she was there a year. Was she? she there a whole year? I don't think so. Anyway, I know she wasn't there two years. Maybe it was a, it was a little bit more than a year, but she was beloved. I mean, absolutely by everybody. She was the best pastor we've I've ever had. And 
I think she would have done it. But anyways, my, my thought is, is that we have always should have had a funeral for Jesus on Good Friday. A full-on you know, eulogy, everything. Because that's basically what Good Friday is. It's the day that we remember the day that Jesus died. And yes, I know on a calendar, an actual calendar, this is not the actual day that Jesus died. I understand that. But it's the day that we remember that. And um, and I always thought that we should have a funeral for Jesus. Does that sound stupid? Does anybody else agree with me? If you are uh, a Christian, or if you have even just a, a, a knowledge, a rudimentary knowledge of the Christian religion, um, what do you think? Is is that seem outrageous or sacrilegious or something? Because I've always wanted to do that. And perhaps this year, you know, something I will do on my own, since it doesn't seem to be something that that my church will ever do. Perhaps I will take some time out of my day and, and have my own, like, memorial service for Jesus. Because, you know... Um, In hindsight, we know that he's he's gone, but that he comes back. I mean, that's that's our entire faith, right? Um, but I think, in and of the day, absolutely, his followers would have a funeral for him, a full-on funeral. We know that they did because. The funerary practices are in the Bible with the shroud and putting him in the tomb and so forth. So we know they had a full-on funeral for him. And I think that's what we should should do. But nobody, nobody else agrees with me. Anyways, this is it. This is my simple bouquet of blooms on this Good Friday. You guys have a blessed day. I will see you next week. Have a good Easter Sunday as 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 we think about um you know, last night uh, Thursday was last supper. Today's Good Friday, the day that Jesus was 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 crucified as as predicted, you know, as as it was uh, required by by God, and then Sunday will be our day of celebration, resurrection. So, um, on this uh, weekend, I ask, hope that you guys are having a really good time, a, a blessed time, a time of 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 thoughtfulness and inward reflection and remembrance and a time of celebration, both in the same weekend. That's that's what makes this weekend really um, special to me is the is the the inward and the outward um, of the whole weekend. That that's that's the part that that drives me and the part that makes Easter special for me. Anyways, you guys have a blessed day. I will see you guys on the next video. Um, remember that in the month of April, I'm going to change my, um, upload schedule instead of Monday, Wednesday, Friday, they're going to be Tuesday, Thursday. Okay. And, um, I will see you then. Have a blessed day, everyone. Bye-bye.